Welcome back. 544 here on your Monday, the first day of school right around the corner. Many kids are dealing with increased anxiety, though, because of the pandemic. Eyewitness News reporter Roger Susanna spoke with an expert who has a few easy tips for parents to help their children deal with their emotions during this complicated time. I practice what I preach at home because it's the only way to, to get through it together. Jessica Collins is ready to tackle one of her toughest tasks as both a mom to two young boys and a mental health professional, helping children deal with anxiety over their return to the classroom in the COVID era. And the more honest you can be and upfront you can be, um, it the kids eventually will appreciate that. Jessica, who is the director of behavioral health at both the Hospital of Central Connecticut and Midstate Medical Center, says each age group faces different challenges. Let's start with teens. Jessica says one of their main sources of anxiety is the constant stream of information and misinformation about the pandemic. So spend time talking about what's really going on in the world in a calm manner. Invite them to join you in watching or discussing news outlets or any other information about COVID. Make sure you're sharing with them what you want them to know. Jessica says kids between 6 and 12 are more likely to question everything and fear things they don't understand. Provide honest answers, but make sure they understand their school and family are taking steps to protect them. You're going to give them enough information as well as enough reassurance that we're doing A, B, and C to keep you safe. Jessica says kids under six will really miss the physical restrictions COVID creates. So provide plenty of hugs when they come home. And at dinner time, she recommends the entire family should share how they're doing. Everybody go around the table and say, what was the best part of your day? What went well? And then sharing something that was especially hard for each of you and kind of going around and sharing that um, because that really balances out. Not every day is perfect, but not every day is awful. Roger Susannon, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.